guys, this is Mike from Rage Break Gaming, and I forgot to get an item from the Queen on Let's Play Final Fantasy IX! Welcome back, guys. Here, take this and go find my daughter. Uh, okay. <laughs> but in the case, you get a prize from Queen Braun here, depending on how well you did during that sword fight. If you get 100, you get a Moonstone. Basically, it's a equip, uh, an accessory item that teaches a spell on the... the the shell spell to a future party member, which really you don't need it right now anyway, and it also teaches the beast killer ability, which we'll be getting from an accessory soon anyway. So really, it's not worth getting right now anyway. The silk shirt at the at the moment is useful, so I'll, at least I got that. Be right back. All right, viewers, I'm back. We're back where we ended the last episode. Now, basically, what we got to do is we're in control of this guy named Steiner. We got to find his Pluto Knights. They're all scattered around the castle. How's it going, dude? Sitting here watching the water always brings peace to my soul. Care to have a seat, Captain? Now is not the time. I bring order from Her Majesty. We must go and search for Princess Garnet. What? This calls for immediate action. Prepare, Princess. Be not afraid. Hygen is on the trail. Feel my fury! No. <laughs> but, yeah, his fury will be felt. Very much felt. Not really. Nobody has come this way either, sir. Uh, okay. Why does that guy not have a name? Hmm. Okay, then. Well, you know what? Never mind. No, no. I'm not going to spoil it. Hey, dude. S hey, let's go to Trino. Just the two of us. Hmm, let me think about it. Are you serious? You there, stop that immediately! Go- Stop hitting on this chick and go search for the princess! Yes sir, I want sir! The fuck was that about? The Pluto Knights always ask me out. I don't know what to do anymore. Huh. Lucky you! Huh. <laughs> no, no, just kidding. But, the Pluto Knights, they ask me out all the time. I don't know what to do. It, it's so hard being so popular and, and, and shit. Oh, I get all these guys asking me out. I don't know what to do with myself. You know what? Never mind. How's it going? Oh, I'm so tired. Oh, Captain Steiner, do you climb this tower for exercise too? No, 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 I'm searching for the princess. Is the princess at the top of this tower or not? I want to reach the top, but at my age, I get so short of breath. How old are you? By the way, Captain, have we all received the order? Yes. All knights will obey! No. Do as I command! No. Was there an extra one? Ah, so you're giving orders to the double super sleuths, Bronson and Coral. Oh, yeah, so he's going to shout out the names of the, um, the, the um, soldiers that you found, and he'll give you an item at the end if you found them all. There you go. That's my cat. In any case, all right, we're getting the elixir. The elixirs in Final Fantasy IX are very, very rare. Part of the too good to use club. I don't recommend using them unless you truly need them. In fact, just save them for like, like the end game, honestly, because that's when they'll be the most useful. Well, some exceptions before then. Ooh, fatigue rears its ugly head. Uh, no, I must preserve. The princess must be found! Hmm. What the hell? Hey, it's Sedane! Wait, over there! It's Princess Garnet! Being hounded by badgers. Fear not, princess! Your knight is coming! Well, I walk slowly over there. You don't like a tower away from you. Hey, how's it going, princess? Are you done running away now? Uh, WHOA! Oh my god! Princess! What the? Oh, come on! She faked this out! <laughs> you ain't getting away, girl! <laughs> Six point landing. You're not getting away from me! Oh, oh shit! <laughs> Dumbass. <laughs> met this Steiner dude and already I like him. Maybe. <laughs> wow. Where'd the princess go? Oof! Literally. Ow! I damn, not, not even I'm sorry for breaking your back possibly. Excuse me, coming through out the way! Kiss my ass. 
No, no. <laughs> the hell? Yeah, let's go after her. Woo! Whoa, what in tarnation? God damn! Hold your horses there. What kind of cattle are you chasing, darling? You should at least say you're sorry. That's exactly what I just said. Please pardon me, I was in a hurry, you see. And here I am fixing to get ready for my big entrance. Oh yeah, viewers, that's the girl Ruby I mentioned um, back in episode one. The one that tells you to stop fooling around when you say Queen, uh, kidnap Queen Bronze 64 times. Yeah, this, this chick with the Texas accent. Hey, or, well, southern accent, really. Hey, Mike, well, I guess not all people in the South have it. Hey, Mike, did you see the way she hit me? This cowgirl is wilder than a bonking bronco. Oh, God. Just let me talk to her, Ruby. Come come again, partner? Did I hear what you were saying? Hey, Ruby, we'll talk later. Jeez. <laughs> there you go. Are you done running? Ooh, looks like you finally made up your mind. Wow, we really had to improvise, but hey, we got her. Mission complete. Do you... Do you work on this theater shit? Ah, so she figured it out, eh? As you have no doubt suspected, the truth is that I'm actually... I am your father. <laughs> no, no. Princess Garnet, Till Alexandros, heir to the throne of Alexandria, I have a favor I wish to ask of you. Please, I wish to be kidnapped right away. Uh, what? I, I don't... I mean, uh... You want to be kidnapped? Princess, where are you? Please, don't come for me. Ah, so that's what's going on. I don't get what's going on, so... We went to kidnap her, but she wants to be kidnapped? Okay. Alright, leave them to me. Thank you, you have my gratitude. Alright then, your highness. I shall hereby do my best to kidnap you. Oh, Shipping confirmed? No. <laughs> Maybe. What are you two doing? Come on, this way. Ah! Don't worry, princess. It's my friend, Senna. Cinnabon. Cinnabons. <laughs> oh, really? I'm sorry you startled me. Yeah, well, with a face like that, I'd be pretty shocked too. <laughs> yeah, look at that red nose, Rudolph. Man, that hurts. I, wa I wash up every day, you know. Princess, this way. All right, we'll follow you. Let's go! All right, princess? Princess? Princess! 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 Princess? Oh my gosh. <laughs> He said, like, princess, like, four or five times. Damn. Where have you been? Sir, I'm sorry, sir. Princess. That makes six. <laughs> hey, Senna, this is a dead end. Hey, I thought this might happen. So, open Sesame. Ooh, a secret passage. Or an escape hatch. Princess. <laughs> Come on, jump inside. Uh, the princess must be down there. I'll go first, sir. Uh, oh, God. My ass is too big. I can't go down. Ah! Hey, what the fuck are you doing? Captain, sir, I'm stuck, sir. Oh, fuck you. Blast it! <laughs> he bought it. Oh, yeah. I knew that was a fake Pluto night. His body, his body didn't look the same as the other Pluto Knights, so he was a dead giveaway. Wow, you're really athletic, Princess. I think I'm falling for you. This is nothing. I've been trained to escape the castle, after all. Why are you escaping in the first place? What a waste. If only you weren't a princess. We have no time for idle banter. Come, let us move on. Aye, aye, your highness. Hey, guys, before we go, though, turn this wheel. Hey! If you reduce the engine power, you'll crash the ship. Turn the reel back to the right. Uh, okay. Now, what happens if we turn the reel to the right? Gotta love fast forward. But yeah, basically, um, turn the wheel to the left and then to the right. You can get some treasure chests to fall. So, there you go. 
Alright, are we done? Cool. Cool. What should we do now? Uh, you stay here while I go get the treasure chest. That's priority number one. So, there you go. We're, ah, there you are. Come over here, we get a phoenix down. Cool. But we're not done yet, my dear viewers. Come over here and we get... A phoenix pinion. Nice. Okay, now we're done. Alright, alright, let's... Actually... Uh, let me equip the dame with... Hmm. I could learn protect the girls for... for for him but really it's not really that worth it if you check the description of the body armors of course some of the body armors and other equipment do have elemental properties to them for example the silk shirt reduces thunder damage by 50 percent very very nice leather shirt don't got that shit so oh well i mean protect girls is useful if you have females in the party but i never really use it so silk shirt it is extra defense for the thing so it can't be beat all right let's get out of here Enough bullshit. Now, whoa! Ha-ha! Princess, I, Steiner, have come to your rescue! You needn't worry, your highness. Good work. This will be remembered as the Blue Knight's finest hour. <laughs> Just relax, princess. We'll get you out of here. The fuck? You're not one of my knights. Who are you? You can just leave the princess to us! Because it's time for a boss fight! Versus Steiner! Yes, we are literally fighting the loud mouth himself. So, there you go. Now, Steiner has 200 HP. Oh, uh, let me see here. Hot Millers, I'll dare you to the princess! No. But in any case, um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Steiner is not weak to anything. So, basically, steal his shit! That's pretty much all you gotta do. He does have another silk shirt that we can get, like that one! Nice. Alright, we got the silk shirt. Kick his ass. We're done. Yoink! Yeah. Ha! Whoa! Holy shit. The yeah, Ascendant's defense is terrible. Not that it matters, because we got him. Or did we? I'll never give up. NEVER! What the fuck kind of technique is that? Armor break? Pretty much. No! Oh, I hate our gloves! Oh! <laughs> Are you serious, bro? Are you serious? I hate our gloves. In the world, get them off of me! Now's our chance. Come on. Okay. That was random. Speaking of random. Tonight, I shall finally see my daughter, Cornelia, betrothed to Prince Snyder? Snyder? Oh, God. And then Prince Snyder and his kingdom will be mine. God! <laughs> that laugh. Your Majesty, we caught an intruder. Why, my poor Marcus. Hmm. Park lad, no matter how much thou, thou treasure, Cornelia, no matter how deeply she might believe she doubt love thee, never shall I see her marry a peasant such as thee. When yon bell strikes three, under the axe thy shall be. <laughs> My villain laugh is terrible, but you guys knew that. Alright, now then. What now? We can't go any further. Hmm. Sedane, so get on number two. Okay, princess, this way. Let's go! Oh no, you don't! Yo! <laughs> you ain't getting away from me. Furthermore, uh, huh? Oh shit, princess! Guys, just improvise. What? Oh, what's all this? Cornelia. Um, Marcus is Cornelia's lover. Oh, <clears throat> oh, Marcus. Yeah, you're doing great. <laughs> I study drama, you know. Okay, guys, let's keep going. Bronze still watching, after all. Even though she's watching that, too. <clears throat> oh, Marcus, I missed you so much. I wish never to leave thy side. Pretty, leave me, leave me from this place. See, King Leo, thou shalt give them thy blessing. Huh, never. Never leave his side, thou sayest. Foolish banter, I will not allow it. Cornelius shall marry none other than this man, Prince Snyder. 
Is that not so, Prince Snyder? Marry the princess? Me? <laughs> Aye, and this traitor's crew will be put to death. Is that so? Oof! <laughs> Literally, too many of them! Run away! Wow. King Leo, your security sucks ass. Pray, sweet daughter, come home to the castle with me. Enough bullshit. Nay, father, I shall in return. Cornelia, trouble me no more. You're, you're starting to become a pain in the ass. This wedding is for thy own welfare. Be mindful of that, because I spent a lot of fucking money on it. Not if I can help it. Now is the, my moment of vengeance for my parents and for my love, Cornelia. I'm going to cut you like a bitch! Ah! Oh, shit! Cornelia! Marcus, forgive me. I still love my father. Oh, Princess! Cornelia! Hetty, forgive my foolishness, father, and spare my sweet Marcus. Oh. Damn. What have I done? Am I never to hear her loving voice again? Am I cursed never again to feel her soft touch? Oh, cruel fate has robbed me of all I treasure! Gadoosh! Marcus! Damn. Oh my! This year's show is splendid! <laughs> Why did she have to die? Why? <laughs> now, where could Garnet be? Oh, oh well, fuck it. <laughs> wow, she's really buying it. Wow, what a show! Yeah, it's so sad. I, I'm glad we climbed all the way over here without paying. How about you, huh? Oh shit! Look out! Villains, come back here! Come back here, trespassers! None shall pass. Oh crap! Fool, I'm out of here! Yo, asshole! He just goes and abandoned the guy that helped him get in here. Douche! Forgive me, princess! <laughs> Leave me alone! I have gardening tools! Stop! Come back here! I said fuck off! Whoa! Yo, yeah, that's hot! Shit! Oh! Mike, it's time! Oh, damn. Cover blown. Princess Garnet, let's get out of here! What the fuck is going on here? Steiner, don't follow me anymore. Even though you totally will because you are, you're kind of stalkerish in a way. Captain, sir, we await your orders, sir. Uh, well, um, uh, fuck it. Princess, I'm afraid I cannot comply with your order. There's no cheeseburgers in Alexandria. No, stubborn as always, aren't you? Come on, Princess, let's just serve Rust a lot and get out of here. <laughs> Rust a lot. Princess, wait! Hey, kid, you okay? Uh, yeah, sorry, I just tripped, that's all. Princess, I cannot allow you to go. Seize them at once! Show no mercy. So it's time for a boss fight! Versus Steiner! Again! Round two. Now, for Steiner this time, sell 200 HP, and he has nothing to steal this time. He got all uh, his cohorts here, um, Hygen and Weimar. Really? They're trash. Get them out the way. The nice thing about Garnet and Vivi is that you can press the, um... Select the spell and press the L, or rather press the R1 button. Like for example, for Garnet, press R1 using Cure, and you can cure our party members. For Vivi, with, with his fire spell, select the spell, and then you want to press L1 to select all enemies. See what I mean? Cool, isn't it? So yeah, basically Garnet is our main healer. Vivi is our main main. So of course. Times will change as we go through the game. You'll see what I mean soon. I'm gonna be late for my date! Hey! Get back here! Wow. Your soldiers suck, dude. But, yeah, maybe you knew that. Gah, only a flesh wound. Tis but a scratch. Oh, yeah, that focus ability that Vivi has? Use that and you can boost up Vivi's next spell. Really cool. Accumulate it a lot and the spells become a lot more powerful. Stabilizer's configured. Good. Engine room ready to go. All right. Let's get the fuck out of here. We're moving out. It's about fucking time. 
But yes, alright, show's over, folks. I'm so sorry you wasted your money. But, you know, yeah, that's, it is what it is. <laughs> yeah, I know, I'm sorry. We gotta go. What are you doing? Get them! Fire! Fire at will! I don't care if my daughter's on you. Kill her, too! Whoa! Shit! Yeah, get him! Get him! Go! Go! Whoa! Whoa! You trying to kill your daughter, too, lady? Wow! Oh! God damn! Oh my god! He's literally crushing people over there! <laughs> oh, we are so gonna get beheaded. Uh oh. Oh, hell no! Shit! It's a. The bomb! <sighs> Nuts. So it's time for a boss fight! Versus Steiner! Again! This time, the last time. Round three. Now, we got a new enemy here. Ba bomb Unfortunately, um, we can't target him at all. And I don't recommend that you even attempt to try, because it won't work anyway. So, yeah, basically, keep, just keep going after Steiner. The bomb will grow. Every time it grows, then, well, it's getting close to, um, you know, exploding. Now, here's the thing. When we do encounter bombs later on in the game as random encounters, every time you physically attack them, they will grow. Just like the bombs that I showed off in my Final Fantasy X HD LP. Remember those guys? Yeah, from the Me and High Road? Yeah, attack them enough, they'll blow the fuck up. So what you want to do is, for, at least for this fight, keep attacking Steiner. Steiner, look behind you! I'm not falling with such a silly trick. Even though I know there's something behind me because it's big enough to the point that it's practically overshadowing my ass. But yeah, Steiner in this fight just has 200 HP, so really, it's not really a big deal. So, pretty much. Alright, let's kick his ass! Enough BS. Surrender! Never surrender! Pretty much. Blaze down! There you go. Are you feeling it, Steiner? It's a bomb! Yeah, literally, it's the bomb. Well, it is the bomb. You'll see what I mean in just a minute. Dude! It's over! It's gonna blow! Blow me? No, well, maybe. Burn! Alright, alright, we got him. It's over. Oh, shit. Oh! oh! Mercy! Yeah, did you not know it was behind you? Oh, SHIT! <laughs> you heard a cat in the background. Are you literally celebrating the death of your daughter? Wow. What a terrible mother. But at least we- I think we survived. Ha <laughs> ha! We got away anyway! Suck on that, you fat bitch! Oh! Uh oh. Damn! Well, um, whoever died down there, I am so sorry. Ripperoni. <laughs> There's nothing I can do about it. Fuck you! <laughs> Look how mad she is! You mad, cow? You mad? She mad. She looks like a cow, but uglier. Oh, god damn that face. In any case... How can someone so how can someone so ugly like that have a beautiful daughter like Gorn? That makes no sense. We're gonna crash! Literally. Hey viewers, I hope you guys um put on your seatbelts. Hang on! Hold on to your drawers! And don't piss in them! And they died. God damn! Well, game over. Garnet. I never imagined you would do such a thing. Perhaps you're not such a helpless little girl anymore. Wow. Zorn! Thorn! Yes, your majesty. Is our little experiment ready? Yes, your majesty. Is combat ready? Easily terminate the princess and king, your majesty. 
dumbasses. I need her alive! Even though I just tried to kill her multiple times in the last few minutes, but bring her back here at once! Wow. What, what does she mean by a little experiment? What is she up to? Hey, Sedane Sir, survived! But where's the princess and everyone else? It looks like we crash landed in a forest somewhere. Oh, shit. Well, there's the ship. At least it didn't completely disintegrate or some shit. <laughs> oh, my back's killing me. You alright? Yeah, but the Prima Vista's wasted. <laughs> Ain't getting this ship to move. Just our luck to crash in this fucking forest. It's gonna get interesting. What do you mean, interesting, boss? I hear no one's ever made it out of here alive. Boss, there's fire everywhere. It's out of control. Quit your whining and get it under control. And get the wounded out of here. Alright. Get our goods out of here, too. Weapons, items, anything we can use. There's no way we can survive if all our stuff is toast. I'm on it. Wow. Who I'm beat. Huh. Hurry up and put out the fire! I can't carry him up by myself! Uh, what the? DUDE! What the fuck are you- He just threw that guy on top of that other guy! Literally. The hell are you doing? The whole ship's gonna burn up! They're looking for Garnet. Can't find her anywhere. Maybe she fell off, got squashed under the ship. Oh, goddamn. First we kidnap her, then we kill her. We'll, we'll, oh yeah, we'll get executed for sure. Pretty much. Oh yeah, oh yeah. They ain't gonna let us live after that shit. Senna! Mike, I'm surprised you made it. I can't believe you jumped off. You're nuts, you know that, right? I didn't jump off, I got thrown out from the impact. So is everyone okay? Yeah, we all got the devil's luck. But if we don't find the princess, we're all dead meat. Pretty much. Uh, what the? A-T-E, Kippo! A-Eight? What? Active time event is a system that allows you to see other events that are happening at the same time elsewhere, Kupo. Press the select button when you see the icon flashing below. Ah, oh, I see. When you press the button any time while the you, you can press the button any time while the icon is flashing. Try pressing select, Kupo. Pretty much. But in any case, whenever you see these ATEs, that means you can check out events that are happening elsewhere from where you currently are. Let's check out the Forest Keeper, our first ATE in the game, the first of many. Whoa! Ah, there they are! Oof! Are you okay? Yeah, is it still coming? Uh... Oh no! Look out! Nuts. Well, the Princess and Vivi are in danger. Pretty much. It's gonna be the... This gotta be the worst situation we've been in. <laughs> Pretty much. In the case, new Moogle here Moscow, but we don't have any mail for him. Save your game! And enter... Dread it, Evil Forest, Ooh. which we'll be exploring next time on Let's Play Final Fantasy IX. Off screen, I will be doing some level grinding here. The enemies here give you a fair, fairly good amount of EXP, so I recommend getting to at least around level 5 or 6 if you can. So yeah, I'll do my grinding off screen, of course. If you guys enjoy, you know what to do, hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel for more gaming videos from me. Hit the bell to so notify whenever I upload new stuff on YouTube. Got something to say? Leave a comment. Till next time, dude, this is Mike from Rage Break Gaming. I hope your rage breaks. Have a great day. Smell you later.